Hey guys, got a quick video for you today talking about Leica, mostly Leica L mount or L mount, but I'll also mention for you M users the benefits of what we're about to talk about compared to if you only have M mount cameras. Stay tuned, today we're talking about Leica L to M adapters. Hello, welcome, Matt here from MrLeica.com. So if you know anything about L mount cameras, which are like a CL, like a SL cameras, and the Panasonic Lumix cameras, the S5 series, L mount accepts autofocus L mount lenses, but with an adapter, you can also use small high quality like a M mount lenses. You can see that the M mount is a small amount to the L mount. So you need an adapter to use M lenses on L mount cameras. So the problem with native M mount lenses, especially vintage native M mount lenses, such as this like a Summerit 51.5, most vintage lenses have a minimum close focus distance of one meter, which means if you shoot portraits the same as me, you kind of sometimes want to get closer for say a tight headshot with say a 50 mm lens and you just physically can't get close enough. Now this is where the L mount becomes really useful in this scenario. So when the L mount was first released, Leica released their own Leica M to L native adapter. This is a fixed adapter, which means if you use a manual focus M lens or LTM lens, you are limited to the close focus distance of that lens. Then a few years ago, Seven Artisans brought out their Seven Artisans L to M close focus adapter. Now this is different because this is a helicoid adapter, which means you can turn it and the lens extends away from the camera body, meaning you can now close focus any lens that you attach to this adapter. Now, because the adapter is M mount, the way I do it is I adapt everything to M mount. So I'll adapt my Leica R lenses to M mount. I'll adapt Leica screw mount lenses to M mount. I'll even adapt Nikon F mount lenses to M mount. And then I can close focus all of those lenses all on the same adapter. And you're like, great, so why don't we just use this? What, what's, what's the problem? Why, why, why do we need a new product? Well, we need a new product because the problem with the 7.5 sans adapter is it doesn't give you infinity focus. It's really good at focusing close, but it won't give you infinity, which means every time I'm testing lenses for you guys for YouTube videos, I always have to carry the Leica adapter for my infinity focus and my 7.5 sans adapter for my close-up focus for model shoots and things like that or product shots whatever you whatever you want to photograph so i always needed to carry two adapters which was really frustrating now what we needed was a company to make one adapter which would give you both close focus and infinity focus and that's what i've got for you today so if we switch places firstly this is not a sponsored video light lens lab did kindly reach out to me and say hey matt do you want to try our new like an m to l adapter and I was like, oh yes, please. So because I owned up quite a few light lens lab things already, I was interested. I'm pretty, I was pretty sure that it was going to be good. And I just wanted to confirm it so I could make a video, compare it to the Seven Artisans Close Focus Adapter and the Leica Close Focus Adapter, and then relay the information back to you guys. Now the key is, will the light lens adapter be sharp at infinity? So that's the test I wanted to do. And I will share those photos next, and then we'll come back for a final verdict. So for my test, I needed to do both infinity test and close focus test. So I needed a model. It was short notice, so I didn't really have any models I could grab. But luckily, one model came in the post just this morning. So let me introduce you to my latest model. She's super sexy and I think will make really great pictures. And she's available at all hours of the day, seven days a week. <laughs> what we've got here is a new latest edition or latest release of the Intrepid 4x5 camera. Thanks Intrepid for getting this shipped to me ahead of my next trip. So here's the infinity test. First with the Leica at infinity, sharp results. Next with the new light lens lab, close focus M to L adapter, sharp results. And lastly with the Seven Artisans M to L close focus adapter, not sharp, hence the problem with this adapter. If we now look at a series of close-up photos, so I can get uh, that close to my subject. These photos first at 0.7 meters with the Leica Lens Lab Elcan 50mm f2. Okay, and now with the 
built-in helicoid of the new light lens lab adapter if we unscrew it to the full extent which means the closest we can possibly get we should be able to get closer so now I can get this close with the same lens so every lens you adapt to this it can be screw mount M mount like a, or anything that you adapt to M mount you can get probably what's that 30 centimeters 40 centimeters probably like half a, half as close again than you would normally be able to with any lens which is amazing so the question is how does this compare to the close focus 7R stands L to M adapter let's try that next so next with the 7R stands close focus adapter first with it fully retracted which means focusing at 0.7 meters so you probably need to back up a little bit so 0.7 meters is about there Okay, and how, fo how close can it focus fully zoomed in? This one's got quite a lot of travel. So fully extended, I can now get, wow. <laughs> that close. So the 7R Sans adapter will still focus closer than the Light Lens Lab adapter, but the 7R Sans adapter will not give you infinity focus, whereas the light lens lab adapter will give you infinity focus. Okay, so what is the verdict? So I've taken all three adapters off the cameras and you can see there is no optical elements. So it's not going to have any impact on the nice lens that you mount to your camera of choice. The advantage of the Leica adapter is it is coded, which means it's going to transfer EXIF data from any six bit coded Leica M out lenses to say your Leica SL. The 7 r Sans one is nice. There is no kind of lever. It's just a kind of a, a knurled edge for your focusing. It, it does the job. And then finally the like lens lab, it's got more like a infinity lock like you'd find on a vintage lens. So this is the nicest design of the three. As I say, these adapters are especially useful if you do portraits or if you use vintage lenses. It can be screw mount lenses like this Summitar that's got the screw mount adapter on, that's what looks slightly different. Or of course, M out to vintage lenses, like this summer rit. If you wanna get this product, I can put a link to Light Lens Lab below. I think the link gives you 5% off if you use the, the link code. Thanks to Light Lens Lab for making us the products that we need. It means I only now need to carry one adapter rather than two. As always, a huge thanks to my amazing patrons. Thanks for watching and you can watch this video next.